guys, Cindy out here with my RT Endeavors. How are you doing today? I'm actually doing pretty well. Um, I feel like playing and painting today, so yeah, we're going to have fun with it. We're here with my RT Endeavors, and this is for the month of August, so let's see what we've got. Um, that one was last month. All right, so here we are. Now, this month's prompt uh, is a little bit different, and I'm, I'm actually going to talk about something I may have talked about in other videos, um, but this subject is really important to me. So, let's start out. I'm just going to stick some things in there. Now, our, while I'm doing this, I'm going to gesso this page, because I have a feeling I'm going to be putting lots of paint on here. Um, so, let's start out. Our prompt. Our prompt this month is says... Do something you don't enjoy. Can you find the benefit of the act? And does this give does this give you a different view on the things you dislike doing? Now I could have taken this anyway. I could have taken it with housework. I hate cleaning the bathroom. Um, thankfully, my husband is great at it. <laughs> um, just there's there's so many things I think in our daily life that we're really not thrilled with, right? Who wants to get up and you know on the weekend and do laundry? Eh, it's not so much the task that you hate; it's just the task that you have to do that you hate. That makes sense. So I didn't really want to go that way on this, and I thought, hmm, I gotta think of something different. And then the other day, uh, my husband and I were talking, and I was like, ta da! That's it. And what we were talking about is the fact that due to the chronic pain that I live in and due to um, how my hips don't like to work and how my back doesn't like to work and the fibromyalgia and all that wonderful stuff, I have to do something I despise doing every time I do it. But there is a benefit for it. So what I have to do, unfortunately, is I have to take what I call down days. Um, I have to take a day or two days or three days, depending on how my body's talking, and I have to stay down, um, meaning I'm either on the couch, chilling out with a uh, binge Netflix day, which it's getting harder and harder to find stuff on Netflix to watch. <laughs> But, because I've watched so much of it, but, um, and then, you know, there's those days where my body just will not allow me to get out of the bed. I'm in so much pain, I just, that's where I'm staying, I'm not moving, I'm not going anywhere, I'm in bed. So, those are my down days. So, you know, those are, it's one of the things that I really don't enjoy doing. And why? Why do I not enjoy doing that? Well, first of all, because it takes me away from my family, my art, the fun, um, anything that I enjoy doing. It takes me away from a lot of that. And that bugs me. I don't like being... Ooh, that's orange. It says it's yellow. Look how orange it is. Let's see. Look how orange that is. That's orange, honey. That's not yellow. Um, anyways... Um, yeah, it takes me away. It takes me, oh, this yellow, look at that. It takes me away from my family. It takes me away from doing things I really enjoy doing. You don't know how many times I will sit here, whether it's late at night while I'm, um, working on my, um, personal journal or I'm just sitting in here playing when bulky Ben or whatever and I think man tomorrow I'd really love to go down to I don't know Hobby Lobby Tuesday morning the consignment shore the thrift store whatever man I'd love to do that tomorrow morning and I wake up the next morning and I can't move so that is one of the reasons I dislike doing it um, what is the benefit the benefit is after a day or two or maybe even three, I get to walk again. <laughs> I get to move. I get to come into my art room. I get to play in my art supplies. I get to enjoy, um, you know, that, that sense of what I call freedom. I feel like when I'm stuck down in these, um, in the bed and stuff, I feel like I'm 
kind of like being jailed, if that makes sense. Um, you know, it's something I have to do. I can't not do it or, you know, I, the, the consequences are really bad. So is there benefits to having down days? Yeah, there is. And do I absolutely hate doing it? I do. I I have always been very proud of myself of not being like a, I call it a couch potato. I can't do that. I can't just sit and just watch TV all day. It drives me crazy. It makes me really frustrated. I want to get up and do something. Um, you know, even if it's just to be able to read, I, I just, I don't know. So anyways, that's what this page is going to be about today. Um, I've got a few different supplies out here. I actually have some stencils. Um, now these my husband had made up for me. And if you're interested in them, let me know. Um, it's kind of hard to see because I haven't done them yet, but um, I've got pain, itch, burn, ouch, hurt, attitude, tears, ache, numb, throb, and sore. Listen, rest, plan, ice, schedule, heat, self-love, and know your trigger. Um, and then I have the positives. Oops, wait a minute. Let's go back to one more negative. Um, sad, angry, confused, empty, alone, lost, helpless, defeated, forgotten, why and aggravated and then I have the positive ones that say be patient be kind take your time stop beating yourself up listen to your body postpone if you need to which I hate doing um, I didn't ask for this and then chronic pain right and then here's another one it says you can do this yes you can it's okay to rest be positive um, it's okay. Baby steps. I am not alone. I love me. I love myself and I am worthy. So I'm going to use some of these, um, stencils today. I think, you know, this is a great chronic pain, um, area to use them in because like I said, it's part of my everyday life. Is it something I want to do? Absolutely not. Is it something I have to do? Yes, I do. Does it have a benefit? Absolutely. Um, another question that we have on this whole process is, does this give you a different view on the things you dislike doing? It does give me a different view. It, it actually, I understand more now what people are going through, especially the um, severely handicapped people. Um, maybe people in wheelchairs or people with um, artificial limbs or, you know, some type of a neurological or muscle disability where they really don't have the choice to be able to say, okay, today I'm going to rest, tomorrow I'm going to go do. Um, so, yeah, it makes me look at it differently. Um, and I realize exactly how lucky I am to be able to actually do the things I do. And even though I have to have those down dates, I can't complain about them. I really can't because I am lucky in, you know, the fact that I do have the ability that I do, the mobility that I do. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to dry this up. We're going to play around with some more paints and some, um, Stencils, I got a few stencils here, just odds and ends that I want to play with and just going to have a good time. So I hope you guys enjoy.
Okay guys, I think I am done with this page. Um, I just had a lot of fun. Um, I did put some pain words over here and then I just, I wanted to cover them up, but you know, one still shows, which is hurt, no big deal. Um, chronic pain, um, be patient, it's okay. And then I just did a little bit of journaling. Um, I'm doing this for me. Take the time to rest, your body will thank you for it. Um, grab your sketchbook, play around with your sketching. Uh, binge watch binge watch Netflix and it's not fun but it's necessary so yeah this is the thing I don't like to do um, but I know I'm better off doing it and I just wanted to share this with you so I hope you guys have enjoyed this you know if, if you're not dealing with any of the chronic pain that's fine um, maybe you know you can take this as just rest when you need to if you're exhausted um, you're doing more harm to your body than you are good so uh, take a siesta <laughs> alright guys I hope you enjoyed this as always don't forget to have fun that's what life's all about happy creating and I'll see you guys next month don't forget about the other artists in the description box below um, there's four of us this year doing the explorations me and I really love it so alright guys talk to you later bye